What does it mean to you to have your film in the Santa Barbara International Film Festival? Um, it's just wonderful to be here for the premiere of the movie. It's a great place to have it begin its life. So we've worked on this movie for a couple of years. This is a great way to have it finally unleash itself onto the world. Couldn't be a more beautiful venue. <laughs> Indeed, yeah, it's lovely. It's so beautiful here. We just came here from Brooklyn, New York, which is where I'm from. What was the most interesting aspect of writing the score for this film? Um, I guess just Sylvia's life. She's such an interesting, incredible lady and her life is so varied and has been through so many chapters that there was so much that inspired me, you know, in terms of melody and, you know, instrumentation. It, it's not a straightforward story. This movie is very complicated and there's a lot of issues that are obviously very important, but in a kind of in a human way, just her her background is so incredible and uh, it was a it was a real privilege to tell her story in that way. What did you do to prepare or to, to find inspiration? Anything in particular? Did you You know, every time I, I start a movie I try to uh, like buy an instrument that will, you know, at least be one kind of very unique sound for that particular score. For this one I, I bought a, a what's it called? A water phone, which is like a it's an instrument with these spikes around it that you pour water in the center of it and you bow it. It has a very specific kind of aquatic vibe-like sound to it. So I guess for every movie I try to make every experience very unique and different and that was the specific element for this one. But you know, this movie again it's so varied and you know, goes to so many places. That's really the, the thing for me that was unique about it.